I said, look at him, slap me now. Say something about slapping me now. The guy wouldn't say nothing. Once these cameras was on there, once these cameras were rolling, once these people were telling the truth, and once these people are for the truth, these people couldn't say nothing because they know they're doing wrong. That's what happened. Okay, now I just got blessed for them people to be here. She couldn't say nothing. Nobody could say nothing. You know, the, 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 these people right here, the cop watch, they're for real. They're for real. Trust me. Hell yeah. Sam, they will save your life. Thank Look you, here. sir. Police got a huge budget and they cut the parks. Okay. Second thing I wanted to bring up is I'm all for police being in shape and doing workouts and stuff like that, but I don't think the public should have to pay for it. Uh, Portland Police have spent years getting the getting the shape they are in now, um, and uh, I think that uh, they should be uh, they should be, they should have exercise routines and stuff like that at the department before they go on duty. Okay, and as far as um, stress caused and all these injuries, they could cause some of them, but the others are caused by other reasons. Uh, they had um, three dr or two drunk drivers injure three officers, um, and I don't believe any of those officers were injured because of their stress. I think even if they had a good night's sleep and ate great and stuff like that, it was still would have happened. Things like that happen. But yeah, I'm all for them having an exercise program. I'm totally against the city paying for it, because like I said, we're cutting parks, we're cutting stuff for our youth, and we're gonna cut that so that we can give police more. That that just doesn't that just doesn't sound right to me. You know? The statistics have shown that the best way to keep youth from committing crimes is have stuff for them to do. The parks is one of them. Twenty seconds left. And so, since the parks are one of them, we should be we should be supporting. We should be putting more money into the parks and cutting more and more into the police department. You know, um, the gang units they need to go. Um, traffic is down to like four officers a shift. Some shifts they don't even have traffic officers. And, uh, but they always have gang units. You know, I always have a gang cop out there. So, I want you to think about that. You're, you're spending your money on stuff, on police, and you're not investing anything in the kids, the community. They're going to take out pools and community centers, and you guys are talking about how we should give police more money. Develop programs for the police. Yeah, okay. we've got to wrap up our comments now. This is this is absolutely sickening. I mean, you're going to take a black youth in North Portland and say, "Well, you We're can't at go three minutes. Your swimming or got to come to an end. You, you, you can't go to the swimming people pool behind you." But the but so the yeah, police can get thank all you the for advocate money. for police gets to talk for twenty that, minutes, but just people yeah. get to. That's called racism. Cause they up to no good, fucking dirty cops. Wanna slam me on the hood, dirty cops. Try to rob me for my rights.